Hey everyone, so this is the first bit of my, well, my, my first video that I'm gonna do. So, <coughs> sorry. So I've, um, I have been back to training. Um, I went back in the middle of January and I was so excited to come back and get back into it and I got my skills back so fast. I'll put the videos in now. As you can see there, that was like my first day doing Jaegers and my first day back on beam, my first time trying to flick again since my operation was on my stomach. Um, so that was my first time doing like a flick and then I was like, oh, it's fine. I'll go straight on to do flick pikes, which I did. And I did it on the beam um, before like doing a day on the floor. Like I did, I went up straight on the beam. So I got all my stuff back fairly quickly and then I just kind of, dropped i went from like being oh you know i want to do this i want to do that to being a bit like i like my happiness started to decrease during the sessions and to get back into it which has quite a big effect on someone that's always loved the sport and i do still love the sport but i've just kind of gone through a bit of a rough patch at the minute so last week i was ill so i think it's a i want to say the 19th or no i think it's the 20th of february today and I was ill last week when I'm pretty sure it was like COVID symptoms. So I, I wasn't in gym for the week. I passed my driving test. And so I had stuff going on and then I wasn't bothered about going back to gym at all, but I'm back now. And um, I'm, I was originally doing two sessions a week and I'm getting back to it slowly, but I'm not very happy in the gym, but I'm trying. I'm about to try a double pike for the first time. Um, let's see how this goes. Um, so it wasn't perfect, but it's okay because we're gonna try another one. Don't know if it will get the same or not, but we'll see. Okay, so I'm gonna have one more attempt and um, let's see if it can go any better. Um, so, obviously, I managed to land that last one. It's still not very pretty at all, um, but that's progress. It will get better over time. And my toes look ugly, but it's fine. It will get there. Then on trampoline, I'm going to do some door toes forwards into the pit. So, there you go. Session over, I was only doing that. Now uh, I'm going to bars. So I've just got my guards on. Um, I can uh, actually upset on this done yesterday. Um, due to my pressure being on my stomach, like my stomach muscles aren't the best. They never really have been, but they, um, you know, aren't great. So I'm going to try today. I've done some yogas, but I'm going to try and do some blind yogas. Don't know how that's gonna go, but we're gonna give it a go. Anyway. So that was my 
first bit of bar session. Um, I've finished there because that's my, oh my gosh, my tripod is, because um, that was my three attempts of my ego. So I'm going to try some double straights now. Again, I couldn't really try it very well yesterday, but we're going to see how this goes into the pit. Or else I think I would die. I really can't dry it still very fast. Um, I haven't quite got that back yet. Obviously I can dry it, but um, not how you want to be drying it so double straight. Um, so I'm gonna try from one giant and see if that actually makes a difference because the two giants haven't doing anything to me. Hey everyone, so it is now Wednesday. And this is my third session of the week and it's the first time I've done three sessions since my operation. Um, I really struggled today to when I come to gym, even though I had quite a good session yesterday. I struggled, I was driving here and I was like, oh, I don't really want to go. Um, I'm going to try and push today. I'm going to try and do some more things than I did yesterday. And we're going to see how it goes.
and beam and it actually went really well. It was the first time I did chain legs, so a bit dodgy. And um, I haven't done my flip pikes for about two, three weeks now. Um, and that was, last time I did it, it was on like a low beam with the mats all the way piled up. So kind of moved on there, which I'm fine with flip pikes. They didn't really bother me too much, but I've had to be a bit careful with them. So when I stretch my stomach out, just need to make sure that I don't strain anything there and don't want to put myself out for longer because I've already had enough of that. Um, I'm going to go to vault now. I don't know what I'm going to do on vault because I haven't vaulted. I vaulted once. In my first time vaulting, I there just tried a one and a half. So we're going to see how this goes because my legs aren't quite there yet either. So. doing like one floor like one day floor or one day vault so i'm gonna do some floor dance now and obviously my floor routine is very bendy so i'm gonna see if i can do that don't know how it's gonna work out but i'm gonna give it a clue I've just done my floor dance and it's just a bit too bendy at the minute for my stomach. So I'm going to go back to being because bars is really busy. I'm going to try some mounts and some dismounts. See how that goes. too ambitious with the stick which is so annoying because I'm so irritated that I haven't stuck it but I think that's me done for being now. Right oh well, you can't see me very well so it's time to do bars and I'm not going to do any yeavers on that today I'm just going to I'm going to work on my giants and I'm going to try some shoe downs that is a vibe today.
for the um like outro bit right now is what it's called for this video but i just wanted to let you know that i completely forgot to video the end like condition and stretching on my last video so i kind of just stopped where it stopped so this is going to go into a bit more Guys, so it's currently a Thursday night and I am at school. For some of you that don't know, I live abroad in school. I've been here since I was 11. If so, if you can hear girls in the background. That's what it is. Um, so I'm currently like halfway through editing my first video and I haven't really done this before. So it's probably not going to be the best, but I will hopefully get used to it and I'm thinking about trying to get a camera so the quality is a bit better for you guys um I've pretty much filmed the whole of training but I've cut some snippets out just so it's not a video that drags on um so the point of this video was just to try and show you like the reality of coming back like I said I kind of like rocketed when I first came back from operation and then like it kind of just went down like I got, I was there, like my energy was up, it was there, and then it just dropped down, and my body didn't work how I felt it should have. Um, but you can see over the past two days that um, I adapted quite quickly. My body can adapt quite quickly to training, which I'm very lucky about. Um, I did do three sessions this week, but I just didn't film the first one. I have got my A level mocks next week so i probably will only be doing the two sessions i have only been doing the two sessions since coming back from my operation this week was the first time i've done three um but as i've had offers from unis i just need to try and get the grades to get into the uni that i've had an offer for um so that's kind of my main priority at the minute as well as getting back into training because obviously that's a massive thing for me um but yeah i just wanted to do this video to show you all what a comeback is like and I'm trying to be really honest with you guys in how my training has been and just so you don't think that if you're going through it in your gym or in your career that it's not normal because it is and it happens to the best of us and it can be really difficult but like I said I just want to show you that it does happen it's one of them and you just have to fight through it so that is the end of the first video guys thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed and please let me know if you have any other ideas whether that be if you want to message me on instagram i'll put another questions up on my story so you can put it there